Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new around here, my name's Danielle and I'm a mum of one. I have a little boy named Leo who is two. I'm based in Essex and as you can probably tell by the title today, I've got a mini B&M haul for I'm you. Two. You are too. Yeah. <laughs> I've got a mini B&M haul for I you. I nipped in today whilst we were waiting one. to pick something up somewhere else. I one. You're not one, no, you're two. Sorry, Leo is literally sat here eating his lunch still. Um, I picked up a few bits. I'm going to share with them today because they're quite nice. And I thought as lockdown is obviously um, easing on the second. If you are looking to get out or um, you are planning on going there, then obviously you get an idea of some things that are in there at the moment. Um, I'm not going to do this in any particular order, to be honest. I'm just going to grab what they've got in the bag and just pull it out. Um, so the first thing that I got was a Sephora. It's a huge 3.99 one. It's the Rose Noir. Um, I have not even smelt this yet, so I'll literally smell it now. Um, I just heard really good things about it, and our Sephora is about to run out. Oh, that's lovely. That's really nice. Um, yeah, so I can... I enjoy just cleaning a bit more when you've got new products and like nice products to powder. use. You're not talcum powder, no. And um, the next thing I got was these fluffy slipper socks for my husband. He was so like cringe when he sees socks. these. You don't like slipper socks, they were four pounds. Um, but they're nice and just cozy I for like Christmas socks. time this year. The little candy cane design. I like slipper up. socks. Yeah, they're really nice. Um, I thought they'd be cute. The next thing that I got was some wax melts. That is the pomegranate ones. We have like a um, wax them. melt, like electric warmer. Smell them. Smell them. Oh, they're lovely. They're really nice, Leo. <laughs> In our plug socket that um, turns the Christmas tree on, our wax melt is plugged into the same ones. So it turns on every time our Christmas tree is turned on. So we definitely needed some more and they were only £1.50 and I think there's nine in there which I thought was really good. Um, I then picked up some of these nail varnishes. They're £4 for a big pack. We've got some really like young girl, like not quite teenage girls in our family that we buy for. And we had actually already bought like this nail set um, to do all like the patterns and stuff on their nails, which I know she'll absolutely love, but it didn't have the nail varnishes with it. So um, yeah, I thought they're really cute colours for like a young girl, basically. And um, the next thing we got, oh, it's, it's one of the bathroom air fresheners. It's the spiced apple scent. They're meant to be really strong. Um, and it. our oil, oil diffuser, I am smelling it. Our oil diffuser. Uh, has just run out in the bathroom, so I'm going to pop this like behind the toilet so you can't really see it. The next thing that I got was these bows for presents. Our colour scheme I'm okay. going with this year. I use the craft paper. Okay. Oh, I don't need to smell these, darling. Thank you. It's one pound fifty. There's quite a few in there, um, but I'm actually going to do accents of like dark emerald green and gold to go with it, and then I've got one extra. Um, like type of paper that I'll use. It hasn't got any glitter in it or anything like that, but it's like green and gold marble effect. It's really nice. Um, so that'll go perfect. I then got, a bit random, but some of the lemon juice, like squeezy stuff. I actually use this to descale the kettle and I haven't done it in ages and the kettle is gross. So um, yeah, I'm gonna do that this afternoon. The next thing, there's two of them. They're my favorite buy actually from today. Are these Christmas mugs? I'll show you those up close. So this one is driving home for Christmas, so £2.50, which is so reasonable, isn't it? But the next one is the Merry and Bright one. I thought I'd get them from myself and my husband. They're a really good size and a really good shape, because we're really like funny about the shape of cups and teacups. It just makes the tea taste better, doesn't it? Um, so yeah, I've got these, and I thought they were really, really sweet. The next thing that I got was the Betty Winters Leo. Betty Winters Christmas cake decorations. They're like snowmen, Christmas trees, stars, um, reindeer. I'll show you those. I just thought they'd be really handy to have in the cupboard when we're doing some of our Christmas baking. Um, Leo would be easy for him to decorate with these, so um, I thought he would love those. And the next lot of things that I got now, we like to do something quite personalised with like each person's present, if you get what I mean. Um, so we always do like photo calendars for like gra the grandparents of Leo and they're always very, very well received. We've always done that. 
Um, but for people like my sister and um, a few of like the grandparents sister. that uh, might want something a little bit extra, um, we actually picked up some photo frames and um, actually what the idea that I had was on Etsy you can actually have certain images like painted into like a line drawing. Um, I saw a few people in there doing it and they looked really really lovely, they're about £40 and you obviously get sent the print and they're gorgeous. But I thought for anyone that was on a budget, I did notice on there that a few people were doing like digital prints of like um, pencil drawings of your image. And I thought it didn't make sense to me that it would be a digital copy. I just thought if it's a pencil drawing, surely you would get the, the actual physical pencil drawing itself, not a digital copy. So when I googled um, online, you can literally download a bunch of free apps on your phone that like changes um, like a photo that you've got, like have a special photo into like a line drawing, or like a, sorry, a pencil drawing or a watercolour drawing. And I had to go, I downloaded the app and I played around with it for about an hour. And some of the pictures that we've got have come out so beautiful. Um, so I've got a couple of these frames. They're blush pink and rose gold. These are both for my sister, actually. Um, I was going to just do a couple of prints of our boys together because um, this will match her bedroom. And I know that she has like redecorated... Um, but yeah, they were two and three pounds and they'll be like a little gift from like the boys basically from Leo and from her little boy Hugo. I then got some of these wooden um, frames for the granddads in the family and they're two ninety nine each. And I thought I would just put in one of these um, like effect pictures that I've done. Like it looks like a watercolour painting, but it'll be like an image of like them and like Leo or like just something like nice like that. Um, yeah, and I just put them into like their little bags, their little stockings. It's two ninety nine. It's a nice, it's you know, it's a cheap but thoughtful present, isn't it? They look lovely. They're really nice quality, um, and it goes with their homes. So I kind of like picked. Bless you. <laughs> what goes with what, really? Um, but that's it for today. I know it's only a mini haul, but I thought I would share because there were some nice little bits in there. And if you're itching to get out, if you can't get out at the moment, or you're waiting, obviously, for the lockdown to be completely lifted, I completely understand, obviously, each to their own. Um, but I thought I'd just share it and um, bring a bit of a distraction, really. Um, I hope you liked this video. Give it a like if you did. And I'd love it if you'd stick around and subscribe. Bye. <laughs>